Hello, I'm Guy Hudson. I'm a physicist and I'm here today to talk about electromagnetic waves, radio waves and health. The range of electromagnetic waves or the electromagnetic spectrum is absolutely huge. The bottom end you've got kind of things like mains frequency, 50 cycles a second. At the top end you've got light, um, x-rays and gamma rays and in between you've got all the massive range of radio. Now conventionally the really strong hard stuff, the x-rays and the gamma rays to do with radioactivity are seen to be very damaging because the energy can go in and it, and it can destroy a cell or certainly biochemicals. But traditionally once you get weaker and less power than light, so your infrared and all the radio range, have been thought to be relatively harmless. And what scientists have found is that unfortunately they're not harmless. They, all the radio waves in the right circumstances or the wrong circumstances do affect your health quite badly. So we're actually kind of bathed in all of this electromagnetic noise. We can't, we can't actually hear it, but our bodies really do respond to it. And so uh, this has got a name, electrosmog. And uh, when I wrote for What Doctors Don't Tell You, they, they called me the electrosmog doctor, because that's basically what I do, is help solve people's electrosmog or random probably harmful electromagnetic waves for them. So all I urge is do be careful out there with radio waves. Thank you. Thanks for listening.